Okay. Um, right. What I'm going to talk about at the moment is um, without uh, uh, doing any doing any preparation. Well, a little bit of preparation. I'm going to read you. Um, first of all, it's about Mozart and about classical music and the sort of um, people that go, that go oh, don't listen to classical music and uh, mainly a lot of it is to do with people who go oh it all sounds the same and all also. firstly if it doesn't grab you I'm not too sure whether you should listen to it or not right so um, if it does grab you uh, that's good. But uh, firstly, an expl explanation of something. I'm going to read something from from uh, Wiki because I, kn I knew that the guy's n name sort of, but I didn't um, completely know his name. But uh, you know, th when you listen to a piece of classical music, it usually ha uh, or Mozart, sorry, M Mozart's music, it, it usually has the letters K something K K, K and then a number. Or KV, and then a number. Uh, for example, Ina Kleiner is K KV five two five, and that means that. What does it mean? <laughs> it means it means that that is the name of the symphony. The the, the five two five is the number of the symphony. It's it's just this guy's cotchel K. O with the two little dots at the that's a, I think they're called ulums, two little dots at the top. K O C H E L dash V V Hang on V V I'll spell it V V E R Z E I C H N I S V Z Z Z Schnis Kotchol I know just know them as Cotchel numbers because of the K, yeah? Cotchel Verzichnis Verzichnis I'm learning it, this as I go along. This is not good. Uh, learn, learn how to pronounce things in German <laughs> or whatever this is. Uh, but yes, right. Uh, that is to demystify that so you understand where that is coming from. The Second thing is uh, is to get hold of good recordings. Um, there, there are a lot, uh, quite a lot about, but um, uh, one of the most annoying things that I find is when they put you on waiting uh, things, and then you get this sort of tear. This sometimes they're all right, but most times, a lot, well, a lot of the time. They, they sound as if they've been blasted through some sort of tin, tin for uh, tannoy or whatever, or speaker, and um, it's not nice really, uh, unless you can, you know, unless you, unless you like listen. I like listening to classical music, but not, uh, well, uh, you know, uh, something about the symphony, the 40th symphony in G minor, and that's K550, right? Um, but by Mozart is um, it's a very sad symphony. Now, from what I know, from what I know, at that time, uh, one of uh, Mozart's children had died. He died. It. His his wife had, you know, uh, had some mi a miscarriage or but it, it, a child died in in. In childbirth or something, or 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 when he was, or when the baby was young or something. I don't, I don't know. But that that because of that sym symphony, that you can you can actually hear in his in the actual symphony itself. You know the the sadness of you know losing a child. Now I don't know this a hundred percent. This is what I just I just know I just heard this somewhere in you know I'm I'm back this up with facts. But anyway, okay, uh, and there's also March number one in C major, KV408, or it might be K408, KV408. Um, and, um, and that apparently is a wedding march at Mozart's wedding, allegedly. So, firstly, 
actually. Well, the, uh, well, second league and third league, probably. Um, if you kind of get a little bit of a background to classical music into you know, what was happening at the time and just do a little bit of research, um, I mean, I don't know whether that's something you could... But, but the idea... Um, if hopefully by giving up, me giving you that kind of information and you understanding that that Mozart was at that, those points in his life. Now I don't know what was happening at the Iron Kleiner. Um, uh, that's kind of, that's kind of that sounds like marches and stuff like that. That sounds like um, uh, something that was probably uh, done by 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 the people that he, he was pa he was paid to um, uh, do do sort of like certain types of music for so you know um, um, anyway uh, yeah I'll stop chuntrin uh, on and uh, hopefully that's sort of uh, demystified just a teensy bit of um, of what Mozart was all about have a lovely day evening, night, universe.